Hey guys, what's going on? Hayden here for more Pokemon Snakewood Nuzlocke Challenge. So, in the last episode, we ended up getting dropped off at Fortree City. Um, and I guess there's no ladders to get up there because they want to stay away from the zombies. So I guess we're just going to go this way. So, looks like we got ourselves a trainer here. The battle zombie slashed to Hayden with her sword. Okay then. So, she's got an Electabug. Bugs. That's not good for old asshole here. My team has a real problem with electric types. I think I'm going to go into Albert. I'm going to use a fake out and a smelling. So oh, she's going to use a zombie liver. That's kind of. Is that cannibalistic? Because she's got a zombie Pokemon. I don't know. <laughs> and a Grim Reaper. Um. I'm going to go. Fuck. Fuck. Um, I'm going to go into GLaDOS, see what happens. Oh, it's a Scyther! Okay, so Spark should be super effective. Okay, yeah, so that's a two-hit kill. Oh, they had the light screen up, so it should have been a one-hit kill. I'm just gonna run back to the Pokemon Center real quick. I'm gonna pick these Pomic Berries for no reason at all, because they are, like... I think they're, like, Pokeblock Berries. So we got another Battle Zombie here. He's got an Azomberol. Um, okay, let's go... Far. I'm gonna go into GLaDOS. I'm gonna use Spark. Looking like a two hit kill. Okay, well, he used Double Edge, so now it could be a two hit kill, but he's gonna use a Zombie Lever. Get a bit of HP back. That's all good, because I'm just gonna Spark him again. Alright, so this is our first encounter for this area. This is, in fact, a new area. So, Zigzagoon, that is Duplicate Claws. We already have one. Come on, give me something other than a Zigzagoon. Well, that's different than a Zigzagoon. Alright, line it is, I guess. Uh, let's just poison sting you. Weaken you a little bit, and let's throw a great ball. Ugh, come on. Are you kidding me? It's a fucking line in. Stay in my ball. Are you, are you fucking serious? There we go, line was caught. You know what? I'm gonna name you. I'm gonna name you Kinky. You know what? No. I'm gonna name you Squirmy. Because fuck, you would not stay in that goddamn ball. Squirmy. There we go. You go to the PC. I'm gonna heal up real quick. I can't believe I just wasted like seven great balls on that thing. Or however many it was. So gotta train. Oh, never mind. Larry the. L oh, Larry the Looter. You are definitely gonna be helpful to me. Oh, gave me those hyper potions. Well, that's why a few antidotes, why the hell not? Paralyzed heal, awakening. So how am I doing for so I've got 30 hyper potions now, I got a bunch of lemonades. Got antidotes, paralyzed heal. I, I am definitely good to go. Let's let's surf down here, see what's happening over here. So we got I think there's an item in this little patch here, if I remember right from the original game. A gloom. Now that that would have been a solid first encounter. I definitely would have been okay with a gloom. Wait, where is it? Oh, there it is. An Ultra Ball. Not bad. Alright, so... Got another item down here. What is it gonna be? It's a Leaf Stone. Okay. That's... I don't know. It's not useful for any of my Pokemon, but I don't know, maybe I'll have something on my team later on. Like, there were Nuzleafs earlier in this game, but it was not my first encounter, so I didn't get one. But, uh, a Shift Tree would have been pretty cool, I guess. So, oh yeah, the Weather Institute, so I guess we have to, like, I guess the zombies have taken it over, so that's kind of why we're here. A Myasmar. Okay, then. Okay, I'm gonna just surf it. Nice one-hit kill with that rain. Not even sure if the rain mattered, I'm just gonna... Oh! He just gave us an HMO5. Is that... Flash? It is Flash, okay. You know, I'm just gonna level up one level, just because... Old asshole here is level 42, and... Could be useful. So there we go, level 42. Nice and easy level up. I'm gonna put someone else in front. I'm gonna put... I'm gonna put Albert in front. The battle zombie slash to Hayden wildly, yada yada yada. So you've got yourself a Grim Reaper. I'm gonna fake out and smelling salt. I don't think these things can learn any flying type moves. At least in this game. So, let's just heal up real quick. This nice little bed here. I, they kept a lot of stuff from the original. Like, I like how it's like elements from the original game, but it's just zombies, and holy fuck. Are you kidding me? Holy shit! 
of Gorlax. There's a fucking chef coming out. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna fake out. I'm gonna fire and thrust. Let's see how much that does. And it's just gonna rest. I'm just gonna go for a few vital throws. Holy shit, that's disturbing. What would you do? Oh my god, why? The creators of this game are sick. But I love this game. Oh, we got another zombie just... Just chilling here, waiting for me. It's gonna slash at me wildly. It's got a Maya Smarr. Just gonna fake out and vital throw. Oh, it's gonna substitute. Just go for a smelling salt then. And electabugs. Uh, I'm gonna go into hoodie on this one. I'm going to ice beam it. Two ice beams are gonna is gonna do the trick. Let's get another battle zombie here. We've got another Grim Reaper. I'll just fake out and smelling salt it. Nice little combo there. And another Grim Reaper. Um, you know what? I'll go into Gary on this one. Fire pump it. And rock throw. Actually, rock throw would have been double super effective. I should have gone for that instead. But I don't. I don't know. Rock throw is a lot weaker than flamethrower, so. So oh shit! It's Gleese. Um, fuck, I'm going to lead off with Gyarados. But he is not on our side anymore, if you guys remember. He is a he's a traitor. Ah, hello, Aiden. Good to see you again. You can't fool me, Gleese. You're not on my side at all, are you? That's inconvenient. You know far too much. I shall have to defeat you and bring you to my master. Forget it. I came here for one reason and one reason only. To free Meteor's daughter. If you choose to get in my way, it'll be you who goes down. Ho ho ho. You've never actually seen Meteor's daughter, have you? What? You'll see. Now let's see if you can match your words with power. Alright, so now we're going to be fighting Gleese, not as an ally though, as an enemy. So Teos Gleese, he's going to send out a Haunter. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to fight it. Could hopefully get a flinch, but he's going to get a Shadow Punch off. Thankfully he does nothing. It's a Viper. You know what, I'll just stay in. I'll surf it. He's going to go for a Glare, that's whatever. Oh, fuck. I'm gonna surf your survivor a few times. I'm gonna bite it. Oh fuck, it swaggered me. But I'm gonna break through it. Face leech. Oh yeah, shit, this thing. Hmm, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go into Albert and fake out it. I know this thing has really shitty defense. Fake out is gonna kill us. Nice. An Alakazam. Oh fuck, what do I wanna do to an Alakazam? Uh, I'm gonna go into GLaDOS. Probably can't hurt me too badly with its psychic moves because I'm a steel type. Although that still does quite a bit of damage. Quill Shark. I'm gonna stay in, but I am gonna have to heal up. I'm gonna use a lemonade. No, I'm gonna hyper potion. Get make sure I get all 81 of my health back close to 80. It's gonna water gun, but that does like nothing. Spark is gonna easily take care of this thing. And Teos Gleese was defeated. That took more to me than I expected. You've defeated me this time. I suppose you'll want some information? Some truth? Well, there's none to be found here. Though if you wish, you could take Meteor's daughter. We've got the dragon egg. What? So Meteor's daughter was just an egg? Why did they need to take over this building just to house this egg? And why was Gleese here? He doesn't work with the horsemen. I'm not just an egg. Oh shit, the egg's talking to us. What was that? It was me. You know, me as Meteor's daughter. This egg can talk? Four horsemen imprisoned me here because now, unborn, because even now, unborn, I'm a powerful psychic. I could have called for help from anywhere, but here, thunderstorms interfere with my abilities. Okay, so what's your name? What's a name? Oh, never mind then. Anyway, I'm going to take you to Meteor. The four horsemen are gone now, and if I bring you back to him, I think you might just stop his destructive rampage. You used too many long words for me. I'm going to sleep. Talk about ungrateful. Looks like we got ourselves a pretty sassy egg here. So, I guess we can just continue on. So we got a zombie here. Oh, sorry, a battle zombie, like always. Or, like usual now, a poly wraith. God damn, okay, I'm gonna go... Oh, fuck, it could use fighting types on GLaDOS, never mind. Um, or fighting attacks, rather. I think I might actually just stay in and Dragon Rage. Okay, I gotta use an Awakening. Just gonna keep on going for Dragon Rage, I think. And one more is gonna do the trick. Hell yeah. So I guess we can continue on. Got a Hyper Potion there. Very nice. 
Zigzagoon, I'm just gonna rock smash it. Almost level 42, that's pretty- Oh shit, caught me off guard there. We've got ourselves a severed head. These things always have eye eyes, the severed heads. I'm just gonna surf it. A few times- Oh, it's gonna lovely kiss me, that's annoying. One more surf is gonna do the trick though. Level 42 Gyarados. Okay, I'm gonna go into Gary for this next eye eye. Just fire pump it. I was gonna burn it, so I'm just gonna finish it with a rock throw. And another eye eye, of course. How how original. So it's gonna fucking lovely kiss me. So I got I gotta heal up. I'm not taking any risks. Uh, lemonade. Gonna use another fucking awakening. Fuck these things, man. Oh my god. Okay, I'm just gonna wait. I'm just gonna wait it out. Get a rock throw off. I'm not gonna waste all my awakenings. Fuck that. So an elixir. Very nice. So there's a zombie down there. I see that. I'm gonna put someone else in front. I'm gonna put. No, let's put Hoodie in front. Give him some more screen time. So we got another battle zombie, of course. The Grim Reaper. This should die to a nice beam. Almost. Oh, it's got wing attack. Okay. I... Now I know it's got flying moves. <laughs> the Zombrel. Let's go into GLaDOS. Easy kill there. And an Electabugs. Let's go into Albert. Bake out and smelling salt it. I like how I get stabbed normal moves for Hariyama, because he does learn quite a few normal moves. So I think we've got an actual regular trainer up here. It's dangerous here. Damn right it is. So you got a Breloom. That's not something I'm going to fuck with. Um, shit, because this thing could take me out with fighting moves. Uh, I think I'm going to go into Gyarados, actually. It's got Counter. Okay, so I'm going to go for Dragon Rage and Surf. Don't want to. Oh fuck! That did a lot of damage. That was a crit, I know, but let's go for one more Dragon Rage. Drago Fury, whatever. I call it Dragon Rage. That's what it is. <laughs> oh shit! It's the deadly fucking seven. Oh god damn, these guys are weird. So I'm just gonna sir. Oh shit! This thing's a. Yeah, it's part psychic. I should not have done that. Matang, let's get out of here. Let's go into Gary. Fire pump. It. Psychic is actually going to do a decent amount, but it's going to get burned. I should not have done that. I should not have risked that. I'm not even going to read what these guys say. It's just pure insanity. So I'm going to actually heal up my guys real quick, because the Deadly 7 seems to be a lot stronger this time around. So he's got a Flaffy. Uh, fuck, I'm going to go into Hoodie. I'm going to Ice Beam. It's going to Light Screen, though. That's annoying. Crunch it. And another Flappy. Alright, let's go. Hmm. I'm gonna go into Albert because he's got the light screen up. Fake out and smelling salt. I don't get static, that's nice. So let's use a paralyzed heal on Hoodie. And keep on fighting through these fuckers. These guys are so weird. Caffy. Still don't really know what these are, if they evolve or whatever. Toro. Oh! Maybe it's a pre-evolution to Tauros. It is a... Like, maybe it's like a... fake -amon, Like, not a zombie Pokemon. Oh shit, okay, there. Poison Sting kills it, and Miltang. Damn, maybe that's... Maybe that's what it is. Um, okay, I'm gonna go into GLaDOS. I'm gonna, wait, why didn't I go into Hariyama? I don't know, I'm... I guess I'm not thinking straight. Still works, though, it's still dead. So these guys are just spewing bullshit out of their mouth. They're... They just say random stuff, it's never important, at least from what I can tell. So I'm going to eliminate up. I'll give you a lemonade too. So you've got yourself a Dragonair. I, oh shit, maybe, I think my Quill Shark is based off Dra Dragonair, like it's artwork. So another Dragonair, I'm going to switch out. I'm going to go into Hoodie, I can Ice Beam this thing. Oh wait, not Ice Breath. Oh well, it's, it's frozen anyway. That's, Ice Breath, it's not very strong, but it almost always freezes, which is really nice. And a Dragonite. Good thing I've got Hoodie here. Ice Beam is gonna eat- How do you have a level 42 Dragonite? You're hacking. You can't have a level 42 Dragonite. Well, it seems my friend is lost in a twisted way- oh, I, Why am I reading this? <laughs> so you've got a Pupitar, not bad. So that's an easy kill. Another Pupitar. Oh, I swear to god, if you have a Tyranitar. 
You do. Okay, I'm gonna go into Hariyama. Because Vital Throw is gonna be double super effective. There we go. So let's get the fuck out of here. We got a medical kit there, that's nice. Some berries. Not that helpful, to be honest. We can't we can't even go over there because we don't have a bike, we have a Vespa. So we got a house here. Never mind, it's a uh, field. I love living in endless plains, it's so dull. Fuck. Just got a shitload of wingalls. This lady is not living a good life. I'm Gabriella. Oh, okay. <laughs> Looks like we got Mr. Briny's boat here. So, like, Tropius. Tropius, or however you say it. That would have been a cool first encounter. Would that just say wine gums? He was just, oh my god, it's a special defense razor. Um, fuck. Gyarados, you can have it. Why the hell not? Wine gums. Jesus Christ. This game is so weird. I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep saying that throughout this playthrough. <laughs> so, Linoon. There's an item there. They're a zombie cuke. Um... A toxic plant that revives a fainted Pokemon. Oh, so we can't even use that. Because that's uh, against the Nuzlocke rules. We've got a trainer here, but he won't fucking... There we go. It's an actual normal tra trainer. He's got a side pig. Um... Okay, I don't think I trust this thing. So it's gonna bite me. I'm just gonna bite it. So uh, I guess it's a psychic type. Obviously, side pig, psychic. <coughs> Is it like a zombie grump pig or something? It's gonna bite this thing a few times. Nice and easy kill. We got another trainer. I'm gonna try and fight him if he doesn't keep fucking off. He's got a what the fuck? Cadjinalanth. Um. Okay, I'm gonna maybe poison this thing. It's got Wonder Guard. Oh fuck, guys. Oh fuck. What type is it? Poison. It's using poison moves. It's got Shadow Punch. Okay, it, I got it with Crunch. Must have been a Psychic type. Holy shit, that was actually kind of scary. Or maybe it was a Ghost type. Fuck, that was actually... I had, no, I had no idea what to do. Like, a fake Pokemon with Wonder Guard is scary as shit. You have no idea what type it is. Hello, they call me Dr. Blackthorn. From Blackthorn City or something? Who might you be? I'm Hayden. I see. That egg you carry, it's intriguing. May I see it? Uh, no, it's kind of valuable. What's going on? What? Could that be? The egg containing Meteor's daughter? Um, as a matter of fact, it is. Why? What's going on? Will someone please tell me? Quiet, the adults are talking. <laughs> What's it to you, Doc? Uh, aren't I like 16 in this game? I'm not an adult. I had heard that someone just attacked the vault, and that Meteor's daughter had been freed. I came rushing over to see if it was true. Thank, thank you for your time. Wait. Yes? Do you know where I can find Meteor I, so I can take his daughter back to him? I believe you ought to head east to Mosty to find the current abode. Now you've, you've quite finished? No, sorry, but just who are you? A concerned party. Let us say no more than that. Hmm? Like you, the current state of affairs worries me, and I am on my own small mission to resolve some of the issues that face this region. I see. I'm sorry to have bothered you. Not at all. Might I offer a small piece of advice? Yeah? These are some troubling times, Hayden. Please remember that in this region, almost everyone will lie to you. I will not claim that you can trust me, but I can tell you that there are fewer than 20 honest people left in Poland, and that you and I are two of them. Please bear this in mind and take care. Oh, fuck. So this is a new area. I think this is a new area. Let me just check. You're 119. Yep, 118. This is a new area, and that zigzagoon does not count as a duplicate. We also have a wing also that does not count as well. That zombie's like on the board there, so an Abra. That is a new encounter, but I'm, I'm gonna try and catch it. It might teleport away. It did not teleport away. Hell yeah. So I'm gonna give a nickname to this Abra. I'm gonna name you, um... I'm gonna name you Magic. Because Abracadabra, Alakazam, are all magic words. And I'm not very creative with names, so this zombie's like bolted to the board. But I'm actually gonna, I'm, I'm not gonna fuck with that. I'm gonna end the episode here. So if you guys are enjoying the series, I'm gonna remind you, of course, show me that by leaving me a like, please. 
uh, leave a comment, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more Pokemon Snakewood and other things Nintendo. Alright, peace out guys, bye.